giant rubber frames present are repaired using nanotechnology. The problem we are tackling today is the complication of cataract surgery. Cataract is clouding that doubles in the lens of the eye. It is caused when ultraviolet rays hit your lens. Your lens is made up of water and protein. So when ultraviolet rays hit your lens, the protein clumps together and makes it very hard to see. The most common treatment for cataract is surgery but one of the after effects of cataract surgery can be retinal detachment. This is a medical emergency that must be treated by an eye surgeon. Enjoy your show and learn how to fix retinal detachment. Why couldn't you see me? I don't know, Jim. My eyesight isn't clear. You need to go see an eye doctor. I already did. Something must be wrong now. Doctor, I had cataract surgery. Why can't I see now? Well, let's take a look. Ah, retinal detachment. You need to go to the hospital immediately to get it fixed. Emergency! Emergency! We have retinal detachment! Retinal detachment! Emergency! Emergency! We have retinal detachment! Welcome to Giant Rover Brains Hospital, located in Hillsborough, New Jersey. Looks like we have a retinal detachment problem coming in. Let's check the monitor. Doctors, what is actually happening to our eye? To our patient's eye, could you explain it further? Certainly, as you know, the problem here is retinal detachment. Retinal detachment happens when the retina tears and the vitreous humors start accumulating behind the retina, which causes the retina to detach further from the back of the eye. To fix that, we have nanobots here made out of polymer and coated with metallic iron oxide particles. Wait a second. What's a nanobot? Why does it have a metallic thing in it? A nanobot is a microscopic robot that, is, that assembles other machines, delivers drugs, or does microsurgery. The polymer nanobots have metallic iron oxide particles coated on them so we can control them with a magnet. So as the monitor shows, the surgeon is injecting a needle into the patient's eye while inserting microscopic nanobots into the cornea. I see! Anyway, the nanobots swim and wiggle through the iris, the lens, and suspensory ligaments to get to the vitreous humor. Once they get there, they suck out the liquidy vitreous humor from inside the retina. They have to do that, otherwise the retina will bulge out and the vision will be distorted. After that, they stitch up the tear, and then finally, the nanobots push the retina into the wall of the eye where it belongs. Surgery is a success. The vision, the, the patient's vision, said has recovered. I'm so relieved I can see. It. I'm so relieved I can see again. Nanotechnology saved my eyesight. I'm really <laughs> too. You can see the blue sky and green trees in the park just like before the surgery. I can. <laughs> <laughs> Good job, kids. Yeah.